Have you ever wondered if processing your own meat would actually make it taste better? We have butchered, ground, and cut our own meat for years, but have had no real proof that it's actually better than any other meat. But today, we have brought three meats to the table. One is from Walmart, another from a commercial butcher, and another that we've butchered with our own equipment. And we will be taste testing all three of them to see which is best today on That's a Farm. So here's how it's gonna work. Mom will cook all three burgers the exact same way, so none of them have the advantage. She also marked the burgers with colored toothpicks, so only she knows which is which. But since I live on a farm and I've eaten my own meat for so long, and I'll probably know which is which anyway, I had to bring in a non-biased person to do the taste testing too. Ladies and gents, give it up for our good friend, Derek. No, mostly applause here, all right. <laughs> Okay. Woo! Let's get it started. I'm waiting all week for this, Brody. All right. Yeah, me too. But while mom is cooking up the burgers, I want to tell you guys about the meats. I honestly think the Walmart meat is going to be the worst. Although it's still organic meat, and it's probably the best you're going to get from Walmart, we actually don't know what's really in it. The box on it says it was chosen from special grass-fed cows from out west. But is Walmart really giving tours of their big commercial meat processing facilities? No. The truth is, we don't really know anything about this meat or what was put in it. The commercial butcher, however, should taste better. Commercial butchering is when you take in your own cow to a butcher to get it slaughtered and cut up. This meat here is from a friend of ours that recently got theirs butchered. The cow was of the South Pole breed, which is really known for their really good meat. But I know for a fact that our beef that we've butchered ourselves with our own equipment is better than a lot of it out there. It doesn't have any gristle or added stuff in it and we also raised the cow ourselves so we know what we put inside it. This burger will taste the best in my opinion. I just hope Derek tastes the same way I do. All right, mom has cooked them to the best of her ability. Let's start burger tasting. Let's start with burger number one. Burger number one. I'm bringing on. Keep in mind that Derek and I do not know which burger is yeah. which. We are only relying on taste to tell us which right. is best. It smells good. Yes, yeah, smells really good. Mmm, got my fork. Let's dig in. All right, ooh, I see the juice is flowing out of it. That's yes. good. Mmm, a little bit rare on the inside. Here we go, taste okay. test. Burger number one. One, two, three. Mmm, that's really good. Not bad. Not bad at all. Mm hmm I don't feel like there's a lot of fat on it. No, very lean. Mm-hmm. For the rest Second of bite. Mm hmm. It's still nice and juicy. It is. It keeps it. You know, it's actually, you know, woo. Not, not bad. I feel like there should be a little more something on it. Like a, yeah. I don't yeah. know. Like it's maybe it, missing an element. I don't know what it is, but yeah. Maybe, maybe, maybe a little more salt. Mm, okay. Yeah. Maybe spice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I like it. Burger number one. Done. Burger number two. It's coming in hot. Burger number two, right off the yeah. grill here. The stove. Yeah. Okay. Mm. How does it smell better than that? Mm. Ooh, it does smell yeah, different. It's, it, it definitely it has a, a different smell to yeah. it, for sure. Okay. Mm. This one's definitely better. Mmm. Mmm. Well, mmm. No, I don't, I don't think know, so. You know, it's a little more chewy. It felt good with that first bite. Yeah. And then as I got into it a little bit. You yeah. Know, the aftertaste started getting less and mm -hmm. less. Mm -hmm. It's like chewing gum too long. You lose I hate its when flavor. That happens, yeah, right? I hate it. No, it's not good. Yeah. It's not bad. No. Um, definitely not the worst burger I've tasted. No, but absolutely not. It's not. I don't know if it goes up to the well, first the McDonald's one. days were pretty bad burgers. Mm. I'm gonna have to go with burger number two for right now. Mm. I that's just me. Mm -hmm. I like burger number one actually better. It's less chewy to me. Mm. Yeah. Burger number two. Try third and final burger. Burger okay. number three. All right. All right. Let's taste it. Oh man. Mm. Oh man. It's smaller than the rest of them. It is. The juices did not flow out like the other two. Yeah. It's either a good thing or a bad thing. Let's find out. It could have sucked it all up. 
Ach so. Oh. Mmh. Mmh. That is. Me. I'm gonna have to another bite. I'm gonna have to dig yeah. in more. Mmm. Very tender. Mm -hmm. Very tender. It's mm -hmm. not as chewy as the second one. No. It tastes like more fat, mm -hmm. more flavor. Mm hmm. Yeah. I'm getting. I really like this one. This one's, yeah, this one's definitely good. It's awesome. Mmm. Vegans, you're no. missing out. Veganism is the sad result of a morally corrupt mind. Reconsider your life. If you don't eat meat, I feel sorry for you. Mm -hmm. I don't know if we have to cut that out or not. Yeah, um, yeah, we'll just go along with it. We're all what? Americans, you know. Beef, it's what's for dinner. Wow. This is awesome. All right. That's good. Burger number three. I'm going yeah. Burger number three is done. So, so what's the consensus? I'm not going right, to come chef. down to it. Um, hmm. Put them all up here. See what Which you got. Which really is it? Green was one. One, two, one. or three. One, two, three. Mm, you know? It's all up to you, Derek, though. I tried to. The world is watching. You the know? world is watching. Mm-hmm. You really have to choose. It's all up one, to you. One and two had a lot more juice coming out. Three yeah. was more lean, but it it tasted really good. I'm gonna have to go with number three on this one. Yeah. So whatever three was, mm -hmm. that's the one I'm gonna choose. Yeah. All three were uh, were pretty good though. Yeah. They, yeah. All of them were all around really good beef. Not nothing bad at all. No. But, yeah. But number three has mine. If I was gonna. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's so, number three for me too. So I number like one. It. Love it. What was number one? Number one was the Walmart beef. Oh, Whoa. so Walmart beef. Oh was, man, it wow. was organic Walmart beef, ninety-three percent lean. Okay, that's what. I, okay, all right. Number I, I two was, was the commercial beef. <gasps> commercial wow. beef. Okay. From a butcher. Oh, commercial beef Friends from a butcher. From okay. Butcher. Okay. All right. And Number. ours was. Number, Number three. three. Number three. Wow. Bed, I did not, <laughs> did not know that. Butchered by yeah. our own hands. <laughs> wow. <laughs> For our equipment, we made the number three beef. And, you know, just because of that, I'm going to take another bite. Here yeah. Because it's that good. <laughs> more beef. We need more beef. Yeah. You want to conclude the summary there? Yeah. I don't, you know, they're all good. Yes. But definitely number three has... Just a more full flavor, yes. less yeah, I really rubbery agree with that. feel to mm -hmm. it. Yeah. yeah. Lot, it, and the flavor doesn't go away after no. a period of time. It stays there. Absolutely. It doesn't fade any. It's um, really good. It is a little bit more crumbly than the other ones. Yeah, it doesn't stay but together. That, but I don't care. Yeah, it know? just tastes better. Because it's all going to one place, you know? Yeah. Right down there. So what would be number two? Number two, you know, it's... Mm, that's a toss up between number two and number one. So, but I want to say number two because when I bit into that for the first, like that first initial bite was really good. Yeah. It had more impact than that first one. Yeah. For me. Although it faded away quickly, it was mm -hmm. still really good. Yeah. At the first quick yes. part. Yeah. Yeah. Well, thank you come, for coming out here. Well, Derek. thanks, thank Brody. So I appreciate it. Yeah. And thank you guys for watching. That's a fun.